Hello, my name is Bill and welcome to Mind Your Crypto. We have a very important video for Ethereum. Before we begin, do not forget to join our monthly subscription, Patreon slash Mind Your Crypto. You will get easy profits trading 200 altcoins, a manual system with over 90% win ratio, personal guidance, educational videos, and many other benefits. Thank you for watching. Have a fantastic day. Let's start right now with Ethereum against USDT chart as we had a nice pretty nice pump because BTC closed above the 24.2k. Right now though, we have approached a very huge resistance level and I want you to be careful and listen to me closely. What we have in the weekly frame, it is a huge resistance level between 1.825 and 1.1k. And why is that? First of all, you will notice something right here that this was a resistance level back here Okay, back on 22 February 2021, a support level around all the way multiple times from May towards July 2021, where we had our next major bull run. Right now, what is the case though? Can we go even, even higher? What are we going to do individually? What you should be careful about? First of all, in the weekly frame, what do we have is the 1.824.65, 1.9K. All right. So therefore, if we close above this area right here, then Ethereum, first of all, will get into an impulsive wave mode in the weekly frame. That means that we can approach higher targets than 2K, maybe going even to the 2.4k. This will be huge for Ethereum because if we break these lines right there, we can assume that we are going towards the next area of resistance level, huge, huge area between 2.4 and 2.5k. That is on the weekly frame. So we are going for the next few weeks. Anyway, right now we are going to see if we are capable of going all the way up higher and retest some higher time frames. First of all, let's go to the daily frame. On the daily scale, we do not have any huge risk apart from the commode channel index. But all you can see right now, it is that most likely we are breaking out of a police pennant formation in the RSI pattern, okay? And so this is very, very good in the daily frame. We are not above the 30s, we do not, the 70s, sorry. We do not have any huge overbought situation right there. So I'm assuming that we can go even, even higher. Into the weekly scale right there, we can see something beautiful. Ethereum was below the 30s. And even the history, if we see that repeating itself, then it means that Ethereum is on its way towards another bull cycle. So all these are helping out so much Ethereum. At the end of the day though, we haven't got above yet and we haven't got into an impulsive wave mode yet. And this is because we haven't broken some important resistance levels and you should be careful about. Now coming into the bearish part, what happens if Ethereum finds the 1824 as a resistance level and approximately it closes this week in this week below these targets right there? Then this will mean that Ethereum is going to re-approach the 1.6k and further down. We are going to draw an important Fibonacci from this bottom up to this top that we are in right now. The first line that Ethereum will retest it is the 1673 coming after the 1.5k and coming after the 1.4k. Is it possible for Ethereum to drop all the way down there? It is possible. Okay, however, we have to wait and see. Going into the logarithmic scale, these lines are changing slightly and we do not have the 1.5k as a major support level. Instead, we are having the 1.6k that we talked about before and the 1.4k. All right, so therefore, yeah, we just lose the 1.5k as a major resistance level, but I'm always seeing the two scales, both logarithmic and regular scale. Right now, you can see that Ethereum is just going insanely good. It is not having a very huge risk in the four hour frame as well. It is looking like it wants to go above the 70s again. I'm not seeing how we can have a huge, huge risk right now. But anyway, you need to be a little bit careful above, apart from the daily frame, we have also the weekly frame in which we have found right now 
a very huge resistance level area for Ethereum if we close above the 1.9k that means that most likely and I would say 1950 okay just to be sure and safe if we close above these lines then that means Ethereum is going probably maybe into an impulsive wave mode in the weekly frame as well that means that in the next weeks Ethereum is going to just go insanely high retesting the 2.4 2.5k this is another huge 23 to 30% profit target okay and then we will see what we are going to do but I do not want to cause any hype yet because right here we are in a critical momentum we are in a critical level of resistance right now and this is why I'm just being a little bit cautiously optimistic okay i'm optimistic but at the end of the day i'm very very cautious because this all thing could be a nice nice bull trap right there anyway for ethereum we had a very nice momentum going all the way up another plus 11 percent plus 20 percent every week right here has become green after every week has become red you can see that it has taken some sort of revenge but it isn't enough yet Ethereum needs to go upwards, we need to retest higher levels, I know that most of you people are hungry to get the bull run restarted, but patience is the key for success in the cryptocurrency market. Thank you so much for watching, do not forget to join our monthly subscription, and see you soon with many many more videos. Bye!